Hello, welcome. I'm Rebecca, and I am the creator of Magical Stock Art. I created it in 2022, and um, I just want to welcome you and give you a little bit of an introduction and then um, let you play. So um, this business has my entire heart, soul, and life. I am in this 100%. I read all your messages. Um, Jen, my associate artist, also reads your messages when it applies to art. Um, I make the art and so does Jen. She's been making a lot of the art lately while I focus on business growth and, um, and the new website that we just built. And I'm recording this in July, 2024. And uh, I've taken, it's been almost a year that I've been building this new website that you're looking at right now um, with a web developer to create as a custom experience. Um, I have uh, the search engine is very robust and unlike any that you'll see anywhere else, um, we've put all the tags on all the images that speak to our members. Um, so if there's something you want to search and you can't find, um, let me know, send me a message and, and we will put that in, we'll put it on our to-do list. Um, cause there's probably a lot of art, um, that may not have like, that represents what you're looking for, but may not have the tag yet. Um, um, we have almost 5,000 images as of as of now, so it's just taken a lot of effort to get everything organized with the right tags and the right places. Anyways, um, um, I ramble. I'm autistic, so it takes me a minute, but I really just wanted you to get to know me and just know that I'm here for you and I'm on your side. And if you need anything, just reach out. Um, and if anything goes wrong, like tech stuff with the site, just reach out. Um, we are still working through some little things that are popping up. Um, but I I check my email most every day and and can get on it as, as quickly as possible. So I'm going to go ahead and share my screen and just show you around a little bit because this is very exciting. And thanks for hanging in there with me. Um, after uh, you watch this video, you will land on um, the website. Sorry, I'm just moving my face around. Um, and this is the home page. So um, you've already created your account. If you ever need to log in again, you click here. Um, like if your browser kicks you out or you go from your phone to your desktop, um, sign Sign up is for any friends that you want to send to us. This is the sign up page. Um, the homepage has a bunch of different collections. You can click on, um, view the art, and download. Um, I just wanted to give you a quick demo on the downloads. Right now, all images have a light box that if you are um, logged in, you can click on it and you can see stuff nice and big and scroll through. And every um, image has a download button for online and for print. They're also right here, if I click on download, for online, for print, or close this. So for online is um, images, uh, the file size is 72 PPI. It's so it's, it's um, made for being used online for like a fast, um, um, What's the word when your image just like shows up on your website? You know, it shows up quickly. 72 is good for that. Um, and for print is for printing. Like if you're doing a book cover or print on demand products like journal or um, mug or necklace or t-shirt. Um, and what you do is you just click for print and it'll download on your browser. Now, once you click the download, I have no control over how it downloads on your device. So just be aware of that. Um, Mac will be different than um, the other one. <laughs> it's my brain. Um, and mobile will, will be different than desktop. If you do have trouble downloading, you can check in with me. And if I know about that device, I will tell you. 
but um otherwise i i don't i i can't help with devices and um also if for print you just click it well, right now, the membership I'm using right now to show you this, the email I'm using, do doesn't have the commercial membership. So this will pop up if you don't have the commercial membership. And what I want to tell you about this is we're in the process of finding the best way to give you commercial usage. I believe in... Um, oops. No, I don't want to share. I want to stop sharing. Oh, here it is. <laughs> Um, no share, stop share. Oh my gosh. I was trying to record like a perfect video. It's not going to happen. Um, commercial, here's the deal with commercial. As of July, 2024, um, we've experimented with a couple different, uh, commercial memberships. Um, and we haven't found quite the right fit. So please give us feedback and respond. If you want to use the images commercially, I want to hear from you because I create this membership for you. I create it for me and my team also because it's our is my business and it's how we make a living, just like how you do your business. Um, but I I I I serve through art and um this this is how I serve. So um, you can use the images commercially. Um, the thing with that is commercial usage is where you will make money off the use of the images. So non-commercial is where you're not directly making money. So let's say you're advertising um, a workshop or an event and you're using the artwork. That's fine. You're making money off the event, not the actual artwork. Or let's say you have a flyer, that's fine. You, all your socials is non-commercial, emails, website. Um, um, also, um, so basically we're following the rules of Shutterstock and Adobe Stock, um, which kind of set the standard in stock photography. Um, so I believe also um, when you're making books, if you're if you're publishing, if you're writing a book, the book cover can be um, is a non-commercial use um, as long as it's under 500,000 reproductions. If you're going larger than that, then we have to talk about that. Um, but I know a lot of you are more like indie authors um, and doing small runs Um which is totally fine for your book covers. But if you want to do a journal, like you're selling the journal to your community or selling the mug or selling the t-shirt, um, that is commercial because you are selling a product with the art on it and making direct money from it. So I just want to make sure you understand that. Um, and so when you make more money from the art, we make more money. Um, for a while, we tried a, a, a profit share um, that didn't go over too well. And now we have a monthly membership for commercial. But what I'm learning is that um, people don't really need that. You just need to buy a handful of images to use commercially. You know, once you make your product, that's it. So we are looking at um, also following Adobe and Shutterstock model of pricing commercial usage per image. Um and that's on the to-do list to, to do on the back end of the website. So it's not set up yet. But if you're interested in commercial, just reach out and we'll find something that works for you. And um, the images on the website are um, 300 PPI. So if you download the four print, they are large enough to print. Um, 300 PPI is what works for... Um, for the, for the professional printers. Um, and these images are sized for probably up to like an 11 by 14 product. So t-shirts, journals, like I said, like yoga mats, if you wanna do those, you need a larger file and we are able to create those. Um, but I think those are gonna be more custom or come later on. So again, if you want to, um, you know, whatever you wanna do, just reach out and we'll make it work. Now the search button is fucking awesome. Um, the search buttons have all these amazing tag words in here. I mean, painted Buddhas, Phoenix, fairies, energy field, dragon. So you can search by subject, um, activities, fabulous, all the things that, that, that beings can be doing. I mean, even astral projection, 
Um, and we're adding more tag words every day. Tags and keywords, same thing. I use them interchangeably. Vibes are more like what's going on, the feelings. We have, uh, let's see, what do we have? Grief. I love this art. Jen made it. Um, like these um, are really beautiful. I just love them. And they're really expressive. Um, color, of course, is explanatory, but we also have different like bright colors and dark colors and pastel colors. And then we also have the actual colors. Place, we're slowly building. I love place, places you can be. And I, I love the swamp. We're going to be adding more swamp pictures. Um, art style, super cool. Um, this is, you know, if you if you understand art styles, um, you know, let's see, like cyanotype is a type of photographic style. Both Jen and I are professional photographers. Um, and so we have all kinds of stuff in here. Um, modality um, is the different modalities of our members, um, which... Oh, it's taken some time to think. I, I did too much at once. This There's a huge back end on this thing. Um, okay, so right now, these are our modalities. If your modality is not here, let me know. We're going to add it. We're, we're, like I said, adding things all the time, adding keywords all the time. Um, modality might change. We might change it to looks because a lot of times in marketing, people want to... Um, use images that represent themselves in their community. So um, different color skins, different color hairs, different color, uh, different body sizes, um, different genders. So we might, um, if we have more tags for looks, we might change out modality. I don't know, we're playing with it. Love to hear your feedback. Um, and then these are the new art drops. So um, every week you get a email with art drops. And um, uh, and they're all and in the email you'll be able to click on the images to come to the art drops and we drop them here for about a month or two. Um, oh, check out the wild woman that was a few weeks ago. That was just beautiful. Sometimes it's loading a little slow. If you are not logged in, you will see a watermark across here saying magical stock art. Just so you know, and you won't be able to click on either of these, and it'll say log in. Um, isn't this cool, the wild woman? Oh, I love it. Um, so these were all the art drops will be every month or two. We um, take them out of here and put them in one of these buttons and then start fresh. So this doesn't get too bogged up. Um, the other thing is if you go to download and your membership has lapsed, um, if your payment didn't go through on in the Stripe portal, you'll get a pop up saying that you need to update your membership and it'll take you to the Stripe portal in the with this new member. With, with this new website, we have transferred all our payments through Stripe um, and we're moving all our older members, all our um, original members. What do they call it? The OG? I still don't know what that stands for. Um, that's my autistic brain. Um, we're transferring everyone over to Stripe. So it's really easy. You have total control. You can... Um, um, update payment method, um, change your membership plan. You can go from monthly to weekly. Uh, no, no, monthly to yearly, which is really cool. You get to save money. Um, and every once in a while, we send out an offer for a lifetime membership, um, which is really cool. Pay once in forever. Last thing I want to show you is the menu. Manage your membership. Uh, this is again the sales page, like the sign up button. Um, this will be where all our commercial information is right now. It's a membership um, as things uh, evolve with the members needs, with your needs. It'll be here. This is details about the images, like I told you, the 300 PPI and the 72 PPI. Cancel. If you want to leave, you click here. Easy peasy. I'm not like I hate all those places that make it so hard to do things. And, you know, I love you and I'm so grateful that you're here and that um, you want to spend your hard earned money um, with my company and which is me and Jen. And actually our Facebook ads manager is also Jen. And um, it's the three of us.
plus a web developer. Um, so you are supporting three amazing women. Both Jen and I are neurodivergent, so that's also cool. Custom art, um, we're still building that out. Right now I'm focusing on commercial, so there's not going to be much here. But if you need something custom, you can reach out. Um, right now Jen's doing all the custom art um, about you. This is really great, and you should be getting an email. Fill out this new member form, please. Um, this will tell us what kind of art you want. It's a Google form. It goes straight to me and Jen. Um, like, what's your business website? Let us come see you, you know, and your socials. What kind of art do you want? Be descriptive, you know? Like, if you want goddess images, do you want them purple or pink or green? And do you want them in a forest or in the sky? Like, the more descriptive you can be, the more we can make art specifically for you. Um, this just tells us about some of your use. We'll probably update that and where you're using it. It's good for us to have this data um, and also where you found us. Good to have the data. Although I think I'll get, I think that's on the other form. I might really have to update this. So this is really helpful. And then la and then also if at any time, at any, any, any time you're like, oh my God, I'm working on, um, you know, I don't know, flowers this month on all my posts and I need some flowers that that look really happy. You just go to the suggestion box um, and we love making art based on feeling. So tell us what kind of artwork you want and how you want to feel, emotions, energy, vibe. And then here's the place. Are you missing a search word? Could you not search up, search something that you need? Give us words. Give us some love. I love taking screenshots of um, people's love that they type in. Um, and I put it on this page about us. Now it's all about me, right? Um, what members are saying. So if you want to get on this page, send us some love. Um, we have a ton of love. I'm so happy. Um, oh, also, if you ever want to make a video, I would fucking love that. Um, I could use that. I want to make a video page of video testimonials. More stuff, how our members use the art. You know, you can look around legal stuff. You can look around at that. Become an affiliate is really great. If you feel like you are have a community that can use this, um, you just sign up. It's a very easy form. Um, you can get $20 cash for every sign up or $20 credit towards a lifetime membership after 24 referrals. Um, it's pretty easy. So what else? Oh, the art collections. Oh, that one has to, oh, this goes back to the homepage. Um, the collections up front. Yeah, we've made so many changes to the site um, that I forget them. But we make changes based on your requests and your challenges. I have members be like, I can't find this thing. And then I go make it really findable. Um, so thank you for hanging out with me. Oh my God, it's been 20 minutes. I'm going to post this anyways. And um, have a great day.